This recording is brought to you by Ancient History Encyclopedia. Medieval Chivalry, written by Mark Cartwright and read by Richard Mom. In medieval Europe, a code of ethics known as chivalry developed which included rules and expectations that the nobility would, at all times, behave in a certain manner. Chivalry was, in addition, a religious, moral and social code which helped distinguish the higher classes from those below them, and which provided a means by which knights could earn themselves a favorable reputation so that they might progress in their careers and personal relations. Evolving from the late 11th century CE onwards, essential chivalric qualities to be displayed included courage, military prowess, honor, loyalty, justice, good manners and generosity, especially to those less fortunate than oneself. Hello, in Sir Walter Scott's Ivanhoe, the medieval knight for whom the novel is named, praises the idea of chivalry to the book's heroine, Rebecca. Chivalry, according to Ivanhoe, 
is but the stay of the oppressed, the redresser of grievances, the curb of the power of the tyrant. Nobility were but an empty name without her, and liberty finds the best protection in her lance and her sword. Chivalry was the code of honour observed by medieval knights. It began as a set of conventions about behaviour on the battlefield and developed into an elaborate code of governing many different aspects of knightly behaviour, from a warrior's moral and religious duties to his love affairs. From the time of the Crusades onwards, chivalry was a significant factor in European society, not just influencing how war was conducted, but also leaving a significant legacy in art, music, and <laughs> Mia Rubin, Professor of Medieval and Early Modern History and Head of the School of History at Queen Mary, University of London.